Adam, two one winners today. Uh, how do you sum up that game? Um, yeah, I thought probably not pretty, but the winds, the conditions, I thought we dealt with it a lot better than we had done uh, previously. Um, but from Tuesday night, I thought we learned a lot. Um, changed up the team a little bit, Ben come in, um, some players coming back. So all in all, I think it's quite positive. Um, I think Oli had a good chance to make it 3-0 and then they go down the other end and, and make it 2-1. Uh, and you know, always think oh, it's the same old, same old us really. Um, could have put the game to bed and then let them back in, but full credit to the players because they dug in and got the result. How frustrating is it when you, you have a clear chance? Well, there's been two or three games now over the last month or so that we've had a clear chance to make it 2-3-0. Missed that chance and they go down the other end and, and score. Yeah, it's it's frustrating, but um, ultimately, you know, we've got the back backing of, of the players. I uh, believe that they're going to find their confidence, and sooner or later, they're going to be putting these chances away. Um, but yeah, it's frustrating, and with that, I think we've gifted goals away as well. So um, I thought it was a lot lot uh, more solid today, and. Um, you know, Ben done excellent for his first game at this level, um, coming in there alongside Joel and Danny. Um, you know, a real young backline, but they showed a lot of maturity and just like to add how pleased I was with Rocco um, after his mistake uh, Tuesday um, to give a performance like that. There's a couple of balls that come flying in at him with the wind. And I thought he dealt with them brilliantly. So, um, how impressive has Rocco been since he's been in? He's obviously come in as a almost as a, a last minute thing with um, the other keeper from Brighton that got injured and, and he's come in and almost he doesn't look out of place at this level. How how no, have you been with him? No, he's been excellent. Been excellent. Um, you know, one mistake I think in ten games from a seventeen year old is is, you know, brilliant really. Um, and the way the maturity he shows um with dealing with mistakes, um it's, it's been excellent. It's been that's like, like I say, faultless really. Um, his kicking was excellent today in, in the wind. Um, you know, when, when we needed it, it needed to be miss out their press and go slightly longer and pick up second balls. It's it's not really us to do that, but I thought we'd done that really well. And you know, like I say, as a team and including Rocco in that, I thought we showed a lot of maturity to that. And how nice was it to see Alfie, Alfie Young back on the pitch after so many months out injured? Yeah, I mean, been really frustrating a uh, few years really for Alfie in terms of um, his game time on the pitch um, so for him to go get back out there uh, hopefully now he's had operation in the summer um, he's cleared up his hernia now and he can just focus on getting minutes and keep on improving but I think we should see today just some of his touches and how what class player he is for this a, level. A good player um, there, isn't it? 100% I mean you can play a variety of positions they would put him in the centre of the field Ross's legs were just starting to go a little bit, so we needed to freshen up in the middle of the pitch. And you know, we had Jalen and Shola and, and Jasper and, and Finn to, to call upon from the bench. Um, and that's with Marvin being injured, um, Joe's tenant suspended, Darren Budd injured. So it's it's a good good squad of players. Um, and yeah, when you get your opportunities, you've got to take it. Um, and I thought that would be done brilliant when I come in. So two or three days off now, the way the Mersham on Tuesday night, what's your thoughts in, in terms of travelling there? What's the same type of game plan? What's your thoughts ahead of that time? Yeah, they're sort of in and around us in the league. So we've um, got an opportunity to sort of push push on now. Um, and we're on a good run in our league form. Um, obviously, the one defeat uh, to St Albans on Tuesday, which was disappointing. But you know, to bounce back today was, was massive. And um, now it's important that we... Uh, maintain our sort of bit of momentum um, and take that into Tuesday night. It's, it's what's expected. I said to the boys, you're, you're part of a big club, we'll take a big following to immerse them away and now you've got to deliver again on Tuesday night. That's what's part and parcel of being uh, part of Worthing. Um, that's, that's what you've got to do and that's what's asked to do. That's it. Thank you. Cheers, mate.